I'm here this morning just to kick off the uh, campaign for uh, a new candidate to the Fine Gael ticket, Lynn McCrave. Um, I want to wish Lynn the very best. I'm a local councillor for the area who isn't seeking a second term. Paula is my yeah. name, but this morning is handed over to Lynn. So without further ado, I'll welcome Rory to the stage. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, I'm more used to being on comedy shows on television <laughs> than I am talking about politicians, but I was delighted to be asked to um, be part of the launch uh, to elect Lynn McCrave as your local councillor for uh, Dublin County Council, South Dublin County Council on May the 24th. It's, it's, local councils need somebody like Lynn. Um, there's no point in just electing anybody who promises what you do. You look at what they've done in the past and Lynn has an impeccable record there. Uh, she supported the Special Olympics Ireland, multi multiple sclerosis Ireland. Um, she's involved in senior coaching roles in secondary schools across a number of um, districts here. And the reason for that is because she used to be, <laughs> believe it or not, the number one badminton player in Ireland, which I think is fantastic. Um, to be number one in anything is brilliant, and, but she used that to get involved with the local community. So we do know that she is community minded. I love the fact that she wants to do things to make things better for the older people. My mother, um, she just died last November, but she had dementia. But beforehand, she was 85 when she died, but beforehand, all that they had in the community for her was like they would have a like a, an old folks club or a, 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 a hospitality thing on Wednesday morning after mass. But for the rest of the week, unless people visited, my mother had no reason to wear the house. And I love what Lynn is doing now that she's trying to make sure that the older people are part of the community and they're supported in the community. Every area has people, mothers with babies and prams or, they, or people with disabilities or in wheelchairs. They need good footpaths to get around. And if they're not maintained, these people are, like especially the people in wheelchairs, they become housebound because it's too much of a hassle to get out. Lynn has noticed all this stuff and she will, she will work hard to ensure that the local community, including all the people who are with disabilities, are able to get out there. I think she's fabulous. So when I was asked to speak here, I had no, like, no second thoughts about it. Yes, because I like this woman. I like what she wants to do. And I love what she's done in the past. So vote for her. That's all I'm saying. Just vote for her. She's fabulous. Thanks very much. <laughs> Thank you.